All right, guys, I'm here now to introduce you guys the um, Tornado Guard, okay? It's a, uh, it's a guard that's a big time for me, you know? Uh, it's a guard that I, I started doing when I was still a blue belt, and when I first did, like, my, my, my first movement on the position, I didn't understand what it was, but I started, I, I thought it was, it was cool. So I started training, 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 and today it became my Tornado Guard. All right, uh, I, I have used this uh, guard in many big tournaments. You know, I have put it on on really big names. You know, it gives you uh, power to go for great submissions, great sweeps, and I'm pretty sure you guys are gonna like it a lot. You know, a lot of people come to ask me about this guard on my seminars. People call me, oh, let's do some privates and stuff. I want to, I want to get to know uh, that guard, and now I'm, uh, I'm putting it on to you. Uh, step by step how to get to the how to get to the to the guard all right I want to show you guys a little bit what is the tornado guard you know because it's a guard that I spin to both sides that's why it's called tornado you know it's a uh, it's a guard that I use a point of a big point of leverage you know that I put the guy on me and I spin around him getting the cert the, the the right points to put the submissions and the sweeps to work so let me show here a little example, okay, to you to understand a little bit what I'm talking about, okay? Even before I put the sweeps to work, you know, and the submissions to work, I want to show just a little example of what it is, you know? I gotta get upside down a lot, you know, to, to put the tornado guard to work. And it's really important you to understand that one leg of mine is gonna be always under him. Most of the positions here are gonna start from half guard, you know, because I need to put his weight on my leg. My other leg, I'm gonna be using as a pendulum, all right, to find the exactly leverage to do my positions, all right? Let me get you to understand a little bit here, okay? Look, I'm on half guard. Important detail here, I'm always grabbing the same leg that, I'm, uh, that I'm, I have the half, okay? Like, not, I have the half guard on this leg, put your leg up, please. Dennis, look, I'm grabbing the bottom of the pants. Why? Because I have to open my guard. As I told you guys, I'm gonna be spinning. So I need something to trap him on me. You know? Okay, let's get upside down now. Oh. Okay guys, I'm upside down. Okay? From here, I need not, I can't trust only on power. Because if you, you fight guys heavier than you all the time. You know? So you gotta understand the technique you do here. You know, to be able to to be able to lift him, you know, to be able to go around him, you know, and place your, and place your hips, okay? But most, most of the position is this, is getting the, the right point to place yourself under your opponent, all right? Now I'm gonna show you some examples, you guys, of what the tornado guard is, all right? Okay guys, now let's start seeing in step by step how to get the point on Tornado Guard. Alright guys, I just want to make sure you understand clearly what like clear what I'm 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 showing you guys. Okay? I'm talk I'm gonna talk about a little bit about the detail on the details of this last two positions that I showed you. All right, about the sweep, okay, and about the triangle. It's not like I'm doing the sweep and like, oh, whatever, I want to get the triangle. No, his reactions are gonna open new options to me, all right? Look, if the guy's all tight, I get upside down, and the guy gets all tight on my leg, all of his weight is on my leg, so he gets light to me, you know? I can use the pendulum to throw him. The only way to him to stop from that is sprawling. You know, if, if he's, but if he's pro, what happens? He opens another world for me, 
You know why? Because he's all open. You know, nobody wants. To, always when you're trying to pass a guard, you're all close, right? Your elbows are together. You know, you're all tight. Why? Because you don't want to expose your arm. You don't want to expose your neck. When the guy sprawls on you, that's what happens. That's the same as you inside of a guard and you put both hands on his on his shoulders. You know, that's exactly what happens. When I spin under him and he opens opens himself, I can see from there many other other options that I can put on him. You know, once I escape my leg there, you know, I'm, his arm is trapped. I can go around and get a triangle. I'll be able to pass under his legs and get a, and take his back. You know, I'm gonna be I'll be able to put omoplat on him. You know, so the sprawl opens like lots other lots other options to me you know it's not oh you know i want to go for this i want to go for that no everything's based everything's based on what he gives me you know i'm going for the sweep he doesn't want to he doesn't want to fly all right you're gonna have to give me something else i'm gonna just show you here what i'm talking about to you guys all right this way here look i have the position all right look when I get upside down, if the guy gets all tight on me, if he gets all tight, look, his weight is on my leg. I'm doing no strength here to lift him up. You know, here, look, I throw him, look. Look, can stop, take a picture here, come back. He's light, you know, he's light. I can flip him anytime I want. When he sprawls, look, he's all open. Look how his arms exp are exposed. See, look, his legs opened, you know, here he, opens like an, a new uh, different kind of attacks uh, world of attacks for me all right so when he sprawls here all right look i can't throw him but in the other hand look his arm here that's mine okay look his arm here look look his arm here look his arm is mine so once i have this and i take my leg off look Look the pressure I get here. See, so I don't go for the triangle only because oh I want it. No, he gave he gave it to me. Okay, he gave me this new option to work on my game. All right, let's go for the next move.